Yeah. And you can help a little bit with your rein, but see if you can, like, put this foot back until they move over. And, and if you want, you can, if you're kicking and there's nothing, then just reach on this rein a little bit, help it out. But keep kicking with that way back until you feel that hip move over, like, keep coming until it moves over just a little more off the track. You can draw on this rein a little more if your legs are pooping out on you. There. 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 Feel that? See, but then that's where you quit, right there. So now start again before he forgets the program here, what's going on. Um, what I'm thinking here on this is, like I, I want to get them these here in a little bit to do it in a standstill. But it just seems like, very good, seems like that if they're moving, they're already moving, so all they got to do is move over. In a standstill, they got to move and then move, uh, yield away. So this seems like the easiest way to do this for people. And what I want to get them so that you can begin to get them ready for lean changes and opening gates and all kinds of different stuff where you need control of the back end of the horse. And so walk a circle, push his hip off co course here. It's going to be... And you know what I might do too? I mean, check them out to see... If they're, um, he can he can walk at the same time. Of course, that's more maneuver for these guys to pick up. Maybe we should stand. I mean, I want to 